Trident Health System is looking to expand to even more locations in the low country. This as the hospital is named one of the 250 best hospitals in the country. This is Jordan Sayopa caught up with the CEO of Trident to see where they're planning to go next and also got an update on another big project. Today I talked with Christina O, oh, the president and CEO of Trident Health. She says Trident is working to expand its services to Johns Island, and she also provided an update on a behavioral health hospital that's in the works. Trident Health spreading across the low country. Currently, families on Johns Island and in the James Island area have to travel over 30 minutes to get health care. And evidence shows that when you're closer to health care, you have better outcomes. According to Christina O, oh, Trident has recently purchased 55 acres of land on Johns Island for $20 million. She says what goes there is up to the community. A really key part at this point is planning for what's needed in that area. And this is where the fun begins. This is where we get to work with community leaders and residents to talk about what type of health care they need close to home. Also in the works at Trident, a brand new behavioral health hospital. This $30 million project has been in the works for a while, but now progress is officially underway. It's the first new behavioral health hospital in the low country in over 30 years. And we're going to be able to take care of not just uh, adult patients, but also adolescent and geriatric psych patients. The 60-bed facility will be located along Ingleside Boulevard with official groundbreaking happening early March. So it's really exciting that we can bring this specialized behavioral health hospital um, close to our Trident home here, but in a dedicated space for those patients. O says that Behavioral Health Hospital is set to open in summer of 2023. Reporting in North Charleston, Jordan Siopa, Count on Two.